<clears throat> Welcome to my tutorial on how to make uh, an epic omelet. What I will be needing here is, first of all, a small pan, a deep, uh, two small flat dishes, a deep dish, a fork and a knife, a spatula, two eggs, some cooked ham, and some cheese. Now, normally I would use uh, mozzarella cheese, but um, I ran out, so I decided to use this cheese. Now, first of all, before we start off, let me place the camera. All right. Now, first of all, I would take the cheese and uh, I'll cut it up into small slice slices. Don't take too much. So just throw them on out. You should eat. I think this one should be enough. Okay. Now we we'll cut it up into the flat dish, into one of your flat dishes. Very, very small pieces. As small as you can. Don't overdo it, but you know. that. Then I'll take the two eggs into the deep dish. And I will beat them. Until you get a nice mixture. Nice homogeneous mixture. Now, when you think you're done, I would add the cheese. Small pieces of cheese in here. Right. Go into the pan. Don't put your flame too high. White oil, so we don't get some crazy fried shit. Okay. All right. Now. While you wait for this to warm up. Pour the mixture in. Use the fork to flatten it out a bit. You know? Make it fill the whole pan. Spread the cheese out well. Your aim is to try and melt the cheese. Okay, now, you should wait a bit until uh, it starts cooking, and then you want to flip it. Now, the most effective method I've found for uh, cooking an omelet like this is to actually use a plate. Now, instead of flipping it normally, or folding it up, or however some people do it, I would... Uh, How do this? Take a plate and you just pour it in. Then I'll go above the sink and just flip it over. That failed. Damn it. 
I guess I was a bit nervous for this. Oh well, it's fucked now. Doesn't matter. And still save it. Okay. There we go. The point was to get it on the cooked side on the top. And the uncooked side on the bottom, so it would cook better. Oh, this, shit can over here. this way, you can cook the other side without fucking up the rest. And normally you should get a nice flat thing looking like this. And now that it's all, all dry because the, there's no mixture left, you can easily flip it. Now I'll keep it on that side. In the meantime, I would uh, prepare my other plate. Put this back in the fridge. Wait for it to cook. How's that for a pancake? What do I need the ham for? Well, this comes at the end. I'm gonna finish cooking this thing. It should be about now. Put this down. Mmm. Smells good. All right, when you're done, turn the gas up. Put that in here. Oh, it's burning. Okay, never mind. I'll take this ham. In your knife. I'll take a couple of these. Maybe two. And what? Right here. Then you can uh, pour wherever you want it. I put oil. And some salt, maybe. And then fold it up. Hold it up like that. And it's ready to eat. Epic omelet with cheese and ham. And everything in it. Alright, thanks a lot.